Now, what is the difference between calculated column and major? Right. Although we discussed few while discussing the demo, but we can have a look in detail as well. Right. So uh, let me open it. Okay. So now uh, you, here you will see there is a table where we have uh, discussed 13 differences. Right. So definition, if you look at it, the a calculated column is an extension of a table that is evaluated for each row. It can be created inside and outside Power BI, Power Query both. So you can uh, calculate a column inside a Power Query as well, right? Because we have various options in Power Query Editor to add multiple types of columns through the add column functionality at the top. So you can have a look at it through the Power BI course. Calculated measure when we talk about when you do not want to compute values for each row, but rather you want to aggregate values from many, many rows in a table, these calculations are majors. So basically calculated column is giving you the results for each and every row and major is just giving you a formula and you can uh, calculate the values depending upon what other combination and parameter you are supplying in the virtual, right? Example, deriving per unit profit of a product by subtracting product cost from the sales price of the product, which we did derive the total profit for all the products, like we did an example for total sales. How they are calculated? Their values are calculated using DEX formulas and values from other columns. And major's values are calculated using DEX formulas and values from other columns, so same. Every calculated major must contain an aggregation function. So you cannot write down a major without an aggregation function, right? Because here in calculated column, we are calculating the value for each and every row. So no aggregation is required, but here you need some aggregation function like average sum. Without an aggregation function, the major's formula will display an error. Calculated column is ideal for detailed information as you are getting the result for each and every row and majors are ideal for summary aggregation and analytical information, right? So when they are computed, Calculated columns are computed on every data refresh, but majors are calculated at the runtime of a visual. Where they are stored, calculated columns are stored in a table in report view, and they are not stored anywhere. They are stored temporarily. You will not be able to see them anywhere, neither in uh, the original data set in Power Query Editor, nor in report view, right? Uh, what about the context limitation? So calculated columns are limited by row context, and calculated majors are limited by filter context. Filter as in whatever other parameters we are supplying in the visual, depending upon that, the value will be calculated. And wherever, whichever row it will be calculated, it will take the reference of that row context. Like it will refer the sales and profit of that row and then will calculate the cost. Uh, here, the calculations are performed horizontally in case of calculated column. And in case of major, the calculations are done vertically. Is it recalculated when a filter is changed? Interesting question, no? So whenever a filter is changed, calculated column is never recalculated because we are not doing anything at the back end with the original data set or we are not touching the formula for calculated column. But in case of major, it is recalculated whenever a filter is changed, right? So if you will edit the filter, of course, the calculation will change and it will be recalculated. How much memory they consume? A calculated column will consume fewer resources while users interact with your report. So we need to check at that memory during the time when the user is interacting with the report. So it makes the use of very, very fewer resources. When we are talking about majors, they recalculate each time the user changes a filter and can cause the report to re respond slowly. So basically majors consume more memory. Usage and column addition, we can use calculated columns to write a major. Interesting, right? We cannot use a major to write down a calculated column, right? I hope this is clear to all of you. Usage and filtering, calculated columns can be used as filters in a slicer and as filters at visual page and report level filter filters, but we can never use a major uh, in a slicer or anywhere in a slicers, basically. Right, so majors cannot be used as filter in a slicer, nor as filters at page and report level, but we can use it as as visual level filter. Right, we will uh, do this practically. 
So I hope you are aware we have three levels of filters in Power BI. So we cannot use it in slicer or page or report level filters, but we can do the same in visual level filter. Usage in other calculations, we can take calculated columns as, as visual, as values in visuals and perform other manipulations like maximum, minimum, count, distinct, distinct count, etc. We take majors as values in visuals, but cannot perform other manipulations like maximum, minimum, distinct count, count. So what it is talking about, like whenever we are creating a visual in Power BI, so whatever you are taking the values, when you right click on that, you get various options to change the kind of calculation you want to perform. But in case of majors, you will not go get those options. But in case of calculated column, you will get that option. Use case, if you need to compute the ratio on aggregates, you cannot use an aggregation of calculated columns. For example, profit margin. You will aggregate the profit and sales and then you will find out the ratio, right? You cannot find out the profit margin for each row and then you can aggregate the same and you can figure out the profit margin. But in case of major, you cannot categorize text or numbers with majors. For example, 0 to 18, 18 to 25 and so on. You have to create calculated column for the same. Right. So this can be done using Power Query Editor, although, but this can be done. This is not possible in major at all. So you cannot create the categories. Right. So these are a lot of differences between major and calculated columns. If you read more, probably you'll get more, but these are the important ones which you should be aware of.